Um, and uh, thank the fans and the media for coming and, uh, and supporting us and covering our game. Uh, obviously, great environment here, homecoming. Had all of our, our uh, family members back in town for a family reunion. Um, you know, the weather, I think, was significant for us today. You know, we've had, we've had some tough situations when it comes to weather. Uh, thought our defense played really well and consistent all day long, especially uh, after the onsides kick and the fumble. Um, we, got to a, we got to a point in the game where the field position was swinging or punting real well. Um, and I think that factored in. We also had a kick out of bounds, which factored in. So our defense was put in a few tough situations and handled it extremely well. Thought we were much more aggressive um, on offense in the passing game, made some plays. Um, still feel like we left some yards on the field, um, but did some nice things. It was a great team win. Talked to our guys about thanking everybody in the locker room, the trainers, the doctors, the managers, everybody, because everybody had a part in it. Thought the scout team was excellent this week. So, um, you know, the fact that we, you know, we didn't have uh, Akil Lynch or, or Saquon Barkley, um, and we were still able to run the ball, um, I think is a, is a, uh, a sign of, of uh, confidence in those guys that we're going to be able to do some things with them as well. Um, it's another example, guys. I know you guys get upset on Monday when the uh, depth chart comes out. Uh, but we were hopeful we were going to have a few of those guys back, and uh, we're, we're told that we wouldn't have them available late in the week. So, um, you know, hopeful again. The, 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 the depth chart will come out again on Monday. You guys will probably comment about how it hasn't changed a whole lot, and um, you know, you'll find out on, on game day who's playing.